I'm Joshua Bardwell, and you're going to learn something today if you have suddenly had your transmitter stop working with your Windows PC. So you go to fly your simulator, whether it's Liftoff, Velocidrone, DRL, whatever it is, and it just it was working yesterday, and now suddenly it's not working. Thanks to Kevin Halterman. He is the head developer of Liftoff. He reached out to me to tell me about this issue and ask me to let you guys know about it. But he's not the only one to have experienced it. And the fix is... Here's the fix right here. You have to reinstall the remote USB driver. I'm not gonna go through the steps right here, but I will put the link to this in the video description. This is how to fix the problem. And also Velocidrone has posted a video. If you prefer a video instead of a PDF, you click that. I'll put both those links down in the video description. I wanna just make a real quick video. There's no ad on this. There's no affiliate links, none of that nonsense. Just a whole bunch of you guys are reaching out to me going, why isn't my transmitter working? This is probably the answer. So check that link out. Thanks to Kevin Holterman and the Liftoff development team for notifying me of this. Thanks to the Velocidrone team for putting out a tutorial of how to fix it. Hope this can get you guys back to enjoying your simulators. Happy flying, everybody.